We have word now that the world's tallest geyser breaks another record in terms of eruptions. As you can see here, we're looking at Yellowstone Park's Steamboat Geyser. I have reported on the Steamboat Geyser many times. But they're saying in 2018, it set a record after being kind of quiet for decades. It would go off every now and then. It actually had a long spell of quietness here between 1911 and 1961 and then started to show spikes in the 1980s. Now, this thing's been kind of roaring back to life. It's got some people saying, is this a sign that there's going to be an eruption in the future? Well, they're saying that it erupted 47 times here in 2019, breaking the record of 32 eruptions in 2018. So it's on the increase constantly. They say that it's not related to any signs of an eruption that's going to happen. But I personally feel like when the day comes with Yellowstone, it's going to happen out of nowhere. There's going to be little to no warning. And they're not going to want to create panic as it is. So I think that things are going to unfold quickly when this goes down and who knows when it's going to happen. All I can say is I hope you have a plan. A lot of people out there don't have one. That is say, the heck with it. If it happens, we'll deal with it then. I'm not going to stress it. I would say if you live within the vicinity of the volcano, the states right around it, I'd definitely be thinking about it and have a plan, especially anything to the east where the plume is going to drift. This will affect the the whole hemisphere so you know it's not nothing to lose sleep over i guess but i would have a plan just as if you live in an earthquake prone region i would expect someone to have a plan for an earthquake if you live next to a volcano have a plan and uh, all in all yellowstone is a beautiful place hopefully i can get back up here and explore it some more and uh, i will continue to update as things change with this region, but Steamboat Geyser, setting records still, and I'm sure it's going to carry on into 2020. I will leave links below. Follow me on Twitter for breaking news, and email me, dabu7 at yahoo.com, if you want to join a bunch of like-minded individuals that are gathering to talk about things that we can't discuss out here on these platforms, things that are getting censored, and just to finally meet in the flesh with a bunch of good people. We put this together just for that and hope to see a bunch of you guys there. Knowledge Conference 2020, March 21st in the Northern Kentucky area. Email me for tickets. Peace.